Welcome back guys to the Legend of Zelda Link Between Worlds as we start off on a little bit of a my my roundup if you can see many red pokey pokey places to go and check out where I've heard a lot of my my chatter so let's get picking them up so we can decide what dungeon to go to next after all we've tempered our master sword we defeated another boss last episode to get another full heart container we're now up to 16 so finding some heart pieces would be pretty good as well but thanks to your comments and the whatnot, I kind of know where some places are, one, some places to check out. Like for example here where it said there's no one near the Ruby Rush game! So there is, I heard the chatter and put down a marker. Now it did fall on a kind of annoying side then, didn't it? I mean making me go all the way round, but that brings us up to 60, which means we should be able to get another two upgrades. That's not bad at all. But in my searches, this place was the most confusing. Because after checking out this lady here... So, I've had a hard time sleeping lately. I've been hearing the strangest little cries from my roof. I've never heard anything like it before. It's keeping me up all night. I kind of thought, okay, it must be a Mai Mai up there. But then I just cut some grass around and found another one myself anyway. There seems to be two right next to each other here. The cries are kind of overlapping, and to get on her roof, as you see there's a little stone. It should be a simple case of cuckoo and fly. That little section where I just had a little bit of a check around and got ourselves some rupees so I could buy the golden bee. Speaking of which, we should turn that in. It worked out quite well for me. I just didn't want to pick them up if you guys weren't watching. In case you wanted to know where the locations were. Oh, be still my beating heart! Is this? Oh my, it is! It's a golden bee! Thank you! She's very bewitching, don't you think? That golden glow, that sweet note of honey that lingers in the air, and so regal, a queen of bees! She's perfect! You have outdone yourself, so please take this as thanks, Buzz! No problem, we got ourselves a bee badge. Now those pesky bees won't pest you anymore! That's the bee badge. As long as you have that with you, bees will be friendly. No more stings. Of course, you know what that means. You can find me even more bees. It should be a breeze. Keep up the good work, Buzz Buzz. And yet another example of how your comments constantly help me out. They really do. Because I wouldn't have known of the bee badge unless I constantly kept saying, strange enough, Oh no, I hope that's not a golden bee that I'm defeating before I defeated them. And there was lots of debate over whether you could get... It must be one under here. Titan Mitt after all. No? Okay, that one here. I heard the chatter. Thought it was definitely that, so I didn't even pick it up to check. There's an interesting section or way into the woods. Is it a place we've been before? Hmm, what's in here? A singular rupee. The tree looks suspicious, but not anything really that good. In fact, isn't this the area that... Oh, wait a second. We've been through that way before, if you know what I mean. We didn't come down that way. Even though we could access it and get to that Mai Mai. Must have thought it was under the Titan Mitt. Maybe we heard it in the past? I can't remember. Let's keep heading around, because at the moment... We've only got one to clear out, and then it's to choose ourselves another dungeon. But yeah, your comments really do help me out. Just bit by bit, help me realise what I've got to do. You spoilerific people, you. Gah. <laughs> Let's keep going and get ourselves yet another Mai Mai, which is up there. Easy to note. And if you remember way back, when we were passing through here in the first place, it's another case of items we didn't have at the time. Titan Mitt will allow us through. Of course, back then, we didn't really have any items. We weren't even searching for the Seven Sages. And so, let's claim another friend. That brings us up to 64, a Nintendo number. So with that said, should we go see what upgrades we can get? We should be able to get two more, and we've cleared out quite a few of the areas. Which is just really nice to think about. Wow, we've got them done. In fact, the only areas we should have are areas that we should be revisiting, I'd imagine. For dungeon or purposes. That's not bad. We've only got two more sages left to save, haven't we? Three areas to check? That's confusing in itself. Hmm. Hello, Mother Mai Mai. We found so many more. I knew you'd be able to help me. Thank you, oh, thank you. Just plop them out. It'll be fine. In fact, that's uh, four sets on the side there. So this will be all the rest. 
Did we come when we had exactly 40 last time? So what should we upgrade? Bow, boomerang, hammer, fire rod, tornado rod. Someone said in the comments I really should do the tornado rod. Tornado rod? Sure. Supposedly an extremely handy defensive item and it even does damage when it's upgraded. We got ourselves to be what, more powerful, nice tornado rod, but it looks a lot different to be honest. Quite a bit crazier. Two tornadoes were if I'm not sure. Mother Mima, you didn't have, have a lot of babies. I can make some of yours nicer. What should we do this time? Should we go with a, a standard item like the bow? That makes sense to me. Mother Mima, you're so helpful in upgrading our gear. Nice new cool items, and another four for you to have, just for the time being, will save more of your babies, I'm sure, in the future. I think 64 is a good number for now, especially considering we haven't entered a lot of these areas, so which one to go to? Which one to go to indeed? Now, sir. I'm guessing things are a bit more crossed off in... Well, actually, I wonder where the divides are in low rules, so to say. That would be interesting in itself. Hello, my mic. Whoa, 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 whoa. We can't grab you by... Hmm, wait. What's going on here? So we can't bump directly into that. The question comes, then, in how to grab you. We can't hook shot on. Right, boomerang maybe? Hmm, this Mai Mai seems to be a bit problematic. How can we grab something that's a little bit up high? I don't think the sand rod works here. Maybe we could tornado it off? We did hit it, that looked kind of cool though. And it does damage and confuses just to boot. Still, not what we needed, not what we could get it with. The bow won't even- oh, wait a second! No, can we get up on this somehow? Maybe there's a way to switch- oh, hello! That Mai Mai is confusing, but maybe there's something in this section that can help us. Now we can really see how the sections are divided. Welcome back to Lural Kingdom, Ollis! You have entered a truly evil place. You must find the dark palace. There you will discover a sage in desperate need of your help. Please, go quickly to the rescue. So say I, Hilda of Lowrule. Okay, madame. Get on this. Yet again, another one on the block here. How are we grabbing you guys? Surely we're not bombing you down. That would be stupid. It seems to hit the Mai Mai, but doesn't really help me get to it yet again. The sand Rod can't be it. Hmm. What is going on here? The Boomerang doesn't work, the Ice Rod probably won't work. It just seems like I'm trying to hurt the Mai Mai more than grab it. And the only other option here that I can think of is just hammering it down. Great spin doesn't work, doesn't let me collect it. I can't bash into it. Am I missing something here? I can't merge into it. Hmm. How to collect those Mai Mai's? That is quite baffling in itself. Well, there's another Mai Mai for our trouble. In fact, we've got some fairies for our trouble as well. Oh, we've got ourselves one Mai Mai. In fact, how many Mai Mai's are in this area of low rule alone? Nine. So, we're going to have to work out a way to get to those ones, if it's maybe an upgraded item that will allow it, but still. Say confusing, I remember us getting one down here, didn't we? It seems with a bee badge, the bees attack the enemies instead, and there was a treasure chest this way. I think I'll take this one, if you don't mind. We got ourselves a silver ruby, a hundred, thank you! Yeah, that's... that's 
really super confuse me now. In the meantime, it's too bad I can't break through you with that. Let's find out what's in this hole. Gotta love how the tempered sword takes care of things without a problem. It's just a fairy fountain, you say? That's not so good. We're looking for heart pieces, my my, is anything we can find? Well, shall we head up into this area? Find out what's going on here, the darkness. You are nearing the dark palace. It is home to the followers of a great and terrible beast. They were once soldiers from Lowell Castle. Now they revere a foul being and cower here in this temple. I accept the responsibility. I was too weak to protect them. They were all good people, my people. If they find you, they will imprison you. Please be careful, so say I, Hilder of Lowrule. Okay then, well I don't intend to be caught. But does this mean I've got a sneak? That would be troublesome in itself. Ah, uh, all intruders must be captured, we must capture all intruders. Hmm, there seems to be... Okay, so we've got to stay away from the front there, but this looks like a path. That we could potentially get through. Oh, not one of you, sir. Use my shield to get nice and close. I was going to say defeat you both, no problem, but that didn't actually turn out so much in that way. We can't get through to this barred area. Is that my potential gel? Well, that guy. Oh, he seems to look around. Well, we'll check out this area down here for the time being, in case anything goody comes about. Find me at one from behind, how dare you! How do I not get that hit in? There we go, a bit slow in my attack, obviously. There we go, get rid of all of you. There does seem to be something bombable down there, though. Definitely another my my up there. Oh, hello, skeleton guy. The exploration shall continue, even if you skeleton me or not. So I have to say anything, we've got to merge across from above to get up to that Mai Mai, but... Ooh, a merging spot, you say? Well, that's interesting, giving ourselves another way back and forth from here. There's probably a Mai Mai or two in this area as well, thinking about it. And if I have to say, wouldn't it be under there? Wouldn't it be? Another fairy fountain, of course. We've already checked out this pot. There was a heart piece there, wasn't there? Or something like that. Hmm. So let's give it a shot then, merging across in both worlds. This is the more question and answer kind of session. Not sure what we're doing, but hoping for the best. Another my my claimed. Brilliant. So, we're nearly up to 70 with those now? And wasn't there still this cave over here that I just could not deal with somehow? I'm still wondering about that a little bit. This cave over this way. Hmm. Oh, and this one here, which I never got to blow up by the look of it. The problem, I think we visited Mother Mai Mai the first time a little bit too late. And so, oh, 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 yes, this is that heart piece. Right, oh, that probably wasn't a good idea, though. So this is, I couldn't reach it from the other point, but from here, it's nice and easy by the look of it. Really nice and easy. We'll take another piece of heart, one more to get a full heart container. Brilliant. Well, I know we're going to have to search through here for Mai Mai's, but... I'm gonna head back from low <laughs> to low for now. I'm quite like chuffed to get myself that heart piece finally. I did kind of go up this area thinking there must be some way to get it by now. Of course, this being the first area that we visited means that it's the one where we were least equipped. And that's not helping anyone really. Excuse me, guys, I'm just gonna go round. Dodge you. I don't mind anything that you throw at me. I'll take another Mai Mai, though. Um, uh, no Rupee Light Likes, I hope. 
Nope, cool. I'm not meaning to attack you, my, my friend. I just want to grab you. And find out what's up here as well. Well, hello, lovely friendly bee. You can follow me around. It's fine. In fact, we seem to be finding fairies everywhere. Okay, we've got a great fairy this time. Tons of fountains all around for us to find. Let's try and get a little bit past that maze. At least we've my mind out this area. Ah, that grass, so annoying, getting in my way. Right, we're not making it round that way, I don't think. Trying to find a route within the water might be an interesting way of doing things, but also the other route. Is it merging? Just fine enough? I was wondering if hitting him might help, but... Right, we got ourselves a double patroller, have we? Well, in the end, I don't think I'm getting any of those. Ah, so I see. We're merging and waiting for them to look. Do -do -do -do. Well, they're not very good guards, that's for sure. Well, that treasure chest is piquing my interest. Ooh, a switch up on high. Well, this way doesn't seem to be anything extravagant and interesting. Right, shall we rain down some ice? Is it a switch or not? That's the question. Seems if I want root. Hmm. Merge, 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 merge. Ooh, that took some time. I was a bit worried there. Right, we cut up. Ha, ah, ah, ha, that was a bit. Shh. <laughs> I hate these stealth sections. They make me want to be quiet. Uh. Still, hello, Mr. Patrolling Guys. Well, I'll just merge past you for the starter. Seems I do have to pop out a bit here. So, you're going to have to move soon? Oh, oh, that's not good. Right, I really need to be on the other side, don't I? In fact, I can keep merging from this side, so there's no reason to wait. Apart from the fact there's a guard up above who's looking around quite nastily. Is that my destination point? It's nice to know, but... Seems there's different cages set around, so maybe we're reaching kind of like a checkpoint system? Oh! Uh. You can't see me down here. Okay, good. Right. Oh, ah, oh, what? The tiniest little wall is my bane. Apart from that, I have to make it past that guy. This is the guy we really have to beat at the moment. Not that I actually need to, uh... Hopefully I can go above this guy without much of a... Oh, you telling me heart piece? Oh, the heart piece is up above! I have been tricked! Perspective, I hate you. Right, with that said, let's keep on going around and hope... Ooh, the... Ooh, he didn't see me. Oh, I fell! I fell! I got caught! I got too locked onto the heart piece, but to be honest, they only put me there. Whoa! I don't want to get caught again. That heart piece is not that hard to get to. In fact, why am I even going the way I am? Because this should be a lot easier. I'll take a heart piece. And that gets us, of course, another full heart container. My mind coming for you as well. Brilliant! So, a heart container for this episode? Loads more my Mai In fact, we're very near another upgrade. Wah! Nearly 70 of them found, and someone just nearly found me. Out my way, guy. Come on then, fire your bomb. We'll be fine. Defeat you out of hand. And... Where are we now? It even looks like you could say we're right back at the start, but we're not. A triple team here. I had to get past the last one. That's actually easier than you would think, to be honest, because it's just simply... Oh, hello, Mr. Looking This Way Consistently. 
You make me wonder what's... Well, it look, does, doesn't really look worth it for the rupees involved, to be honest. Well, I do wonder what's down the other side of here. Nothing whatsoever, you say? Well, that's disappointing. I'll just pop out over here, wake you up, sir. And it seems the Dark Palace has been found. Another dungeon lying right here right now for us to break into. With a little bit of differing and dallying, we got there in the end. I'm pretty sure that was t over 10 my mys for the episode. A heart container filled. Our next dungeon reached. Puzzles completed. And so we head in to the Dark Palace next episode, guys. Join me then for more Legend of Zelda. A link between worlds, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye.